Oh, it's set off back here. That's kind of strange. <laughs> I guess that's how it happens. You get one of these that sets it all off, sets it off, and then anybody behind them gets fried. So, um, <clears throat> got that done now. It's like back up here somewhere, or rather, uh, over here somewhere. So, um, let's go and go back to the college. That's kind of a weird little thing of clouds there. What the hell? Huh. Right over Azura's shrine. I've never seen Ereg outside of the library before. Maybe he can go steal some stuff now. He's not in there watching things like a bloody hawk. <clears throat> Alright, so uh, next up on the list is going to be... Greetings, well, let's see. I guess we got up here to Azura's Shrine. We'll just walk there. So, take the path out southeasterly path and then just take the first left that we find I think then left uh, or first right and then the second right first right on that path what the hell it's moving it actually kind of looks kind of freaky it's like you know attack of the space blob or Cloud blob or whatever. Space cloud. If there's anything you need, Archmage, just let me know. These vampires are becoming a real menace. I don't know about that. I need some, you know, light magic. Oh hell, Master Vampire. That's a bear out there somewhere. For example, right now, um, it may look kind of smooth to you, but to me it feels a little jittery. The, uh, just the, you know, there's almost a little bit of jittery thing going on, but that could be, I guess, from the, according to the hard drive. I suppose. 
preparing to eat right now. I don't think this is the path. Oh, what the hell? Oh, what the frick? Kill that bastard. Where the hell are they going? Not saying that you're a real badass, you have a skull cod piece. Oh, what the hell? What the frick? What in the crap is going on? Holy hell, man. I mean, just what the frick? I've never seen any kind of all these kind of things before. And look at all these freaking soldiers. Man, what the hell? <laughs> it's like, what the frick? Now see, without um, <coughs> uh, SSME, that would have crashed so fast. Because there was so much RAM being used there, but I bet we got up close to uh, uh, 586 on that one. I have SSME set to uh, 756 uh, or whatever the one is after 512. The half step up. That's crazy. Goat. Fusra goat. That <laughs> worked. Hilarious. Too bad for you, goat. Anybody else see that game uh, in Steam, Goat Simulator? I think it was hilarious. The trailer for it was. Seriously, I put it on my wish list. I'm seriously thinking about getting it. It's just such a hilarious looking game. Oh, we're getting close to the point where we need to go to. Somebody up here. Or something. Storm click, I guess. Winterhold. What the hell's a Winterhold guard doing out here? Yeah, why the hell are you so far out from, uh... From Winterhold. So where's the battle at? I hear the battle music. Where are these guys? How do you feel? I think you might be sick. The mercy of Stendar does not extend to Daedra warships. You're bloated with disease. The vigilant of Stendar can help you as long as you promise to never assist the Daedra. Really? Stendar's light purify you of your evil. None escape the vigil. I guess that uh, vampire had had uh, 
infected me. So that's what I don't like about finding vampires is that they don't actually have to bite you. You just have to, you know, there's a certain chance for hit from a vampire that you can get turned into one. Oh, frick. Thanks for nothing. Well, I believe this is the path. Let's go ahead and save real quick. Just in case. We crash. <clears throat> What the hell? <coughs> oh, ice nuggets. What the frick? Hey, a balancing act. <clears throat> what were they fighting? A skeever? Now oh, the carcass is rolled down and off, huh? I bet so. Well, I'm not gonna go chasing after it. It's either a skeever or like a wolf pup or something. Wasn't that big of an enemy. I think this might be the path up here. Snow Devil. Get back here, you wuss. Sorry, pay no attention to the huge lumbering person behind you with a large weapon that's aiming for your butt. There's no chance you're gonna die from that. <clears throat> Is this actually like a temple that you can go into, like um, Meridians? Or no? No, I guess not. <clears throat> Shrine, I guess. It's just a huge ass thing. I don't think I've been here before. Azura has seen your coming, traveler. It's not curiosity, but fate has led you. Oh, really? This shrine was built by the Dunman. As our land was scorched by fire and brimstone, Azura's prophecy led us to safety. She is a date. <coughs> A powerful being who watches from beyond our mortal plane. She has chosen you to be her champion. You must go to a fortress endangered by water, yet untouched by water. Inside, you will find an elven mage who can turn the brightest star as black as night. It is cryptic, I know. But Azura's signs are never wrong. I believe the fortress may refer to Winterhold. Ask if they know this elven enchanter. She is the goddess of dawn and death. Azura sees into the twilight of the future and guides her followers through. She is the goddess of dawn. My people, the Dunna, built it. We fled from Morrowind after Vardenfell erupted. It was 200 years ago. Those of us who were faithful to Azura were given a vision that led us away from the island before the worst came. This shrine is our thanks to her. 
that none will forget that she watches over us all. Yes, there were others at first, but Azura's visions tested everyone's faith. One by one, they left, afraid to know their own future. <laughs> but I refuse to abandon the shrine. The visions are a gift. Azura warns me of tragedy, war, death, before it happens. I won't leave her back. Oh, really? This has all been foreseen. All right, well, so winter hold. Ouch. <clears throat> I wonder if there's a back way up here. <clears throat> Not a back way, certainly a faster way down. Yeah, that's this. Might be a fast way down. I might die, but it could be a fast way down. Of course, Jordis and, and uh, Gore are not going to be able to follow me down this way. I frequently take paths like this so that just take me down much faster than going all the way back around. Okay, this could hurt. Ah, damn it. I didn't think that would have killed me. What the hell? Maybe I should have tried to hold the cast down to it instead. Maybe we'll, I think we'll load back up at uh, where we just were. Yeah, we saved that up here. No biggie. I guess it was a good thing I did save, not because of a crash, but because I frickin' died. Yo! I really didn't do anything to that. Surprisingly. Now, according to one of those uh, kind of loading cards, whatever I saw, you can take your uh, power strike and move it around when you're doing it. It's supposed to result in a different kind of strike being done, but I just tried that there and eh, nothing happened. <clears throat> so I think it's full of crap. The game itself is. <laughs> oh, epic. Foos. Fus Roda. Oh, wait, we got the thing going. <clears throat> Alright, back up here to uh, restart the quest. I'm not going to do all the dialogue again because we already know all that. Run! Oh, wow. That's so hilarious. My um, stamina regen is so fast that I can run indefinitely because. I can't drain the little last bit of stamina. That is very interesting. That doesn't make any sense though. I wonder if it's a bug maybe. So that shouldn't be possible. Otherwise it just regenerate all the time. And we wouldn't lose any. That is odd. Azura has seen your coming, Traveler. Azura, you have been chosen. You must get It is cryptic, I know. But Azura's signs are never wrong. I believe that they're... Yeah. Alright, let's try this again. This time I'm gonna I'm gonna save it up here though. In case we do die again, so 
if I kick off, I'm not gonna have to go all the way back up and do all that again. So save 44. Yes, to overwrite. <clears throat> and I'm also gonna go ahead and restart recording real quick. All right, so let's go ahead and see what happens here. I'm also going to try using Wolden the Kest once we get to that one point uh, so that um, we can accelerate into the ground but not through a uh, through gravity but through a, a shot. I think that'll, that'll keep us alive. Wolden the Kest. Damn. You can't do it while you're floating, I guess. We'll have to sit there and do it then. It's ridiculous. Oh hell, that did a lot of damage. Wow. Wold the cast. Oh damn it. Sounds like this makes me wish I had turned quick shots back on. This is more realistic though, in terms of the actual gameplay though. You can't just do shots all willy nilly. <clears throat> do you think the Dragon Board wouldn't be, you know, have that kind of. Tr <laughs> you should be able to use shots whenever you want to. I mean, come on. Shouldn't be any kind of cooldown time. Wooled. Damn it, it's not working still. Well, let's try going down a little less insanely. How good that works. Goddamn hook's not working properly for... Thumic. Yo. Okay, now it's working. Of course, now it's working. Now that I'm actually down the hill. There was a quest at one point in time we could have undertaken that related to those uh, pods or whatever you want to call them. Uh, it's given by Mirabel, but once she dies, uh, you completely miss out on it. Of course, I did talk to her. She wasn't actually giving it, so I don't know what the hell is going on with that. Hello oh, there. Hello, uh, you slow pokes. You can't take the proper way down. I don't know, who would we talk to that would know that? I guess maybe Tolfdeer would know. I can also give him his damn Alembic. That's also another rating quest, because you can take that over and over again. Um, I'll keep, you know, senile idiot will keep on losing his, his Alembic everywhere. Need a magic it to his forehead or something. Oh wow, well, everybody's in here. Greetings, Archmage. I wonder if the librarian at Cyrodiil leaves all the cleaning duties to a single apprentice. I'm always available should you need me, Archmage. Well, I can't find If you happen to see it, would you mind bringing it to me? 
Ah, yes, there it is. Thank you so much. Study stars, you say? Why, that has no made doing anything related to stars since school. Well, it's a minor stain on the college's reputation. One of many, unfortunately. You should head to the frozen heart and speak with Nelikov. It's his story to tell. And I wouldn't want to discredit him by talking to him on his back. Actually, yes, Archmage. I believe there is. We've been contacted by the Jarl of Ripton. It would seem there's some sort of disturbance. From what few details we were given, it sounds quite familiar. I suspect that the power released by the Eye of Magnus was not fully contained and has coalesced in this part of Skyrim. I do hope you still have the Staff of Magnus someplace. I suspect you're going to need it. That's interesting. That one before. If you need Archmage, just let me know. Don't take this the wrong way, but you look a little sickly. Again? I'd better get going. Good day, friend. I never would have suspected that the eye could be so dangerous. Tolfdir is right, isn't he? Magic really can overwhelm you. Just Arco. But fears warmness from your presence. Um Yeah, but before I that must be a radiant quest too, because the first time I had, uh was playing through the game. What the hell? How the hell did she get out of here already? It's weird. I wonder if it's a duplicate. Anyway, um... The first time I had uh, been playing through the game, that was actually over near uh, Whiterun. Or rather, Windhelm. Not, um, Riften. The, uh, Eye of Magnus stuff. The, uh, Aftershock quest, rather. I wonder if there's multiple ones of those. Not sure. I think I got the Eye of Magnus back up there in the... Our staff of Magnus back up there in the uh Archmage's quarters. I was wondering what this guy was, was, what the story of this guy was, so I asked to deal with uh, Azura's quest. Azura's quest. It's interesting. Anything you need, just let me know. I'm afraid there's not much to be said. Interhold is harder than it used to be. You can talk to Beer now if you need to buy anything. He doesn't have much, but he certainly used to come. And then there's our little gate. Most of the business we get is from folks here to visit the college. But even that's dry up somewhere. Until next time. Words of the clan mother. That's a new one. My days at the college are long behind me, but I prefer to stay close by. Dagor and I have an understanding. He gives me privacy, and I make sure my experiments don't blow up his <laughs> I guess that's some understanding. <clears throat>